Hey guys, so I wanted to come on here and show you guys the progress that I've made with my ornament wreath so far. I actually started this last year and never finished it, so I decided to get it back out and start working on it. I would like to have it done in the next day or two because I am going to display it this Christmas season. So I purchased the foam wreath, as you can see in the middle, from Dollar Tree last year. And... I decided to go with just all different colors of Christmas ornaments only because these are unwanted or unused ornaments that I'm no longer using on my tree. So it's kind of a good way to put your old ornaments to use as well. A lot of people when they make these they do different color combinations like red and gold, red and green, silver and blue. And I am going to do another one with a color combination. I think I'm going to do one in all red and black with Santa's belt in the middle. I saw it on Pinterest and it's super cute, but for now I decided to go with this one. So I still need to fill in all these blank spots with these smaller ornaments, but as I was going through and playing around with them, because once I got to the smaller ones and filling in the blank spots, I would kind of set them in there before I'd glue them down to see what it was gonna look like. And I noticed that as I was setting them in there, it's not turning out super even. So I wanted to get your guys' opinion. <clears throat> what do you guys think I should do? Should I continue to just try to fill it in with the smaller Christmas ornament slash bulbs? Or do you think there's something else I should add to it to fill in those blank spots? I was also contemplating on adding a Christmas bow right here, but I'm not sure about that. I'll have to put one there and see what it looks like. If I like it, I'll hot glue it. If not, I'll just leave it like this. So I had also got these from Walmart last year and... I really don't like them. I will not put them on my tree. I didn't put them on my tree last year, but I thought it would be cute to somehow incorporate these onto this wreath, but there's no room and there was no way for me to get them on there without it looking uneven. So one other thing, I had showed you guys these silver napkin rings that I got from Dollar Tree. They're in this kind of metallic silver mirrored look. And I told you guys that I wanted to glue something onto each one of them or four of them for each one of my place settings at this table for Christmas. And I had bought this pack of ornaments or embellishments, whatever you want to call them. And as you can see, the top one is in this really pretty shiny look, just like the napkin rings. So I thought maybe it would be pretty to hot glue that on there and then put like red cloth um, napkins in there or red and green I'm not sure but then once I took the top one off you guys all the rest of them which you probably can't tell because the light is washing it out but all the rest of them are not shiny they're in like this kind of dull look so I don't like these so I also wanted to get your guys's opinion on what you guys think I should glue to these or hot glue to these napkin rings if you have any suggestions Leave it in the comment section below. Thanksgiving is tomorrow. I'm going to be doing cooking today. I hope you guys have a happy, safe Thanksgiving. I'm actually going to be going to the movies tonight. And then I'm going to be doing Thanksgiving tomorrow with my family. So I think it's going to be a good day. If you guys would like to be notified when one of my videos is uploaded, subscribe to my channel. It helps me out. And then, like I said, it lets you guys know as soon as I upload a new video. You can also go to my Instagram, which is breakup to makeup one If you would like to look at my pictures, just send me a request. Send me one message saying YouTube so I know where it is that I know you from and I will approve you. But please give me like a day or two to approve you because I'm not always on my Instagram. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.